Hello, shiny, happy people. Welcome to Kimba's Crafts. My name is Kim, and if you're new here, hello, welcome. If you're returning, love you guys. So I actually started this video, and I started to organize my um, drills, and I'm gonna add that part of the video in after this because I, I realized I didn't explain to you why I do my kit up the way I do. I tried to explain it in a kitten chat, I think it was a kitten chat or a whip and chat. Um, I don't feel like I did a really good job at doing that. And um, I, I felt like I was kind of like confusing. I was confusing myself. So it must have been confusing for some people. And um, just try, I'm going to try to explain to you why I personally feel that organizing this many colors into categories is the most efficient way to kit up, okay? Now, there's a number of ways to kit up, right? You can kit up by, um, well, I guess for the these these J walls, because there's, like, I, I have, um, let me see. Here are the, here's the original. Let's see, here is the original papers, okay, that come in the kit. And they don't, they're not one, two, three, four, five, six. They don't have one, two, three, four, five, six on the sides here. So if you kit up one, two, three, four, five, six, um, you would have to write the numbers down next to the symbols. And um, so that would be... Uh, that would be extra work. So, you know, some people, they kit up one, two. So if they're 60 colors, they kit up in their kit one through 60, right? And they, they, they will label their containers one to 60. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then they would put the corresponding one, two, three, whatever. Um, they, there's also you can kit up by DMC number or in DMC order. So 150, I have 150, 152, 154, 150, 152, 154, that way. Um, and then keep them in DMC order. I've seen some people say they, they kit it up in color categories so that if you saw, you know, your symbol was blue, you would go into the blue box or you would go into the blue area. Um, <clears throat> if I, if I would say that would be the second best way to kit up. And, um, and then I, I, those are the only ways that I can think of and then categories. So what I mean by categories is taking, um, like, making categories and putting your symbols in those categories. Like these would go into triangles, okay? That car would go into transportation, all right? Um, now the reason why I'm saying that kidding up like one through 60, in this case, it would be one through 250 or DMC order is because you would have to refer to the legend. Now, these kits are extremely confetti heavy. You could have a hundred colors in one square. So that essentially means that you are looking at the canvas, right? Seeing a symbol and you recognize the symbol, you know the symbol, but you need now need to translate it into a DMC color by going to this to this three page list of symbols and finding the symbol. Okay. Oh, here it is, the lion face. Okay, it's number 762. Then going to your now going to your containers and finding the 700s and saying, oh, here it is. Okay, it's this one. Okay, and then you have to do that maybe a hundred times per square. So going from the canvas, recognizing the symbol, translate it into a DMC number, 
then finding that DMC number in your container. Canvas, legend, container. Canvas, legend, container. A hundred times. Then, uh-oh, wait, I forgot, I forgot a lion face. What was that again? I gotta go find the lion face again. I mean, you might be doing that like 200 times in a square. That's a lot of, and, and, and same goes with, you know, one to 250, you know, lion face. Wait, what number is that? Oh, here it is. It's number 65. Okay, 65. Here's 65. I mean, that's a lot of looking things up. Okay. Now, when I did it category wise, and I didn't make this idea up. I got this idea from Diamonds and Washi. So I just want to throw that out there. She does. Ha I, I think she has a video on it. Um, I didn't watch like a kid up video or anything like that. I, I watched, um, I watched a lot of that series though. And, um, I heard her talk about her kidding them up in categories. Maybe I did watch it. It was a long time ago. So maybe I did watch her. I think she's, she has a um, video on how to diamond paint. I think it's called like how to diamond paint a large canvas or something like that. So maybe I did watch that video and it was very, very helpful. Or I just got it through one of her videos. I'm not sure. But it was not my idea. I watched a lot of Josephine Wall kit ups to um, come up with a system that I felt was very useful. Now, I got the idea to use these pods from Emeralds and Fairy Lights. And I'll explain why I use the specific kit up, these specific kit up containers. I've done all this in my Unif Unicorn Kiss series, but I'm just kicking it off in this series. I didn't know how well it was gonna work or not work for me um, because obviously it was the first time I ever did one and it worked really, really well for me. So I feel very confident in saying that this is a great way to kit up a very large project with a lot of colors, a max color canvas. Um, okay, so if you kit up in categories, right? You're going to have these, I, I would have these laid out or, or on my canvas. And very quickly, you will learn, okay, all my triangles are on the left side of one of these containers. My numbers and letters are on the left side. My people are on the right side. So as you're looking at your canvas, now you're taking the symbol, okay? So I'm taking lion face and I'm like, okay, it's a face. It's in, it's in people. Um, I would take lion face and I would say, okay, which one has people? I know it's on the right side. Oh, here's people. Okay. Oh, here's lion face. Take lion face out, you know, do my thing, put lion face back. All right. The next symbol I'm going to do is a, where's my letters? My letters are on the right, on the left side. Oh, here's letters. Okay, where's A? All right, there's A. I mean, I'm not referring to this three-page legend because I'm taking symbol and finding symbol. Does that make sense? I'm not taking symbol and finding a DMC color. I'm not taking symbol and finding a number and then going and finding a DMC color or a number. I'm taking symbol and I'm finding symbol. So I feel like maybe that description is a little easier. Um, now the reason why I like these uh, containers is when I get to the end of a square and I see all the things that I've done already and I missed and I'm like, Oh, okay. I did lion face, but oh, here's a lion face. Oh, this is lion face. I pick it out. I take my pen. I can pop one of my subs. Jess, she calls this pot diving. It's perfect. Literally. Boom. Put it on my canvas. What else did I miss? Oh, I keep these open, right? Oh, I missed that letter A. Here's letter A. Okay, done. That quick. Okay, as opposed to, again, oh, I missed a lion face. Where was lion face again? 
Oh, it's DMC 762. Where's 700s? Here's 700s. Oh, here's 7762. Perfect. You know? Oh, A. Where's A again? Which one was A? A was number... Hmm. Let's see. Where's A? A. I think it might have been... Was it on the last page? No, there. that was C. Um... Seriously, I thought there was an A. Oh, here it is. Okay, that's number 20. Number 20, where's 20? Here's the here's the 20s. Like, it's, it's a lot, right? And it's like, how many times are you going to do that? It's going to be a lot of times. As opposed to, you know, any of these. Like, oh, megaphone. Where's my tools? Megaphone. I need a megaphone. Okay, here's tools. Where's the megaphone? Okay, right here. Perfect. Done. What's the next one? A P. Oh, here, my letters and numbers are over here. Here's P. Done. What's the next one? Oh, a sailboat. Where's transportation? Oh, here's transportation. Sailboat. Done. See what I mean? Okay. Well, you guys, obviously, you guys have to do what's easy for you. And, you know, you can even put, like, on the top here, transportation, letters, numbers. And you can have them propped up and you can just, like, see, you know, if you don't want to memorize a box, whatever, you know. Um, but, and another thing is, Last time I I filled up multiple containers a lot of times. Um, but I'm going to tell you, because of how heavy the confetti was, I never, ever used a whole box in any square. Um, I usually, you know, would finish multiple squares before I ran out of any color in a box and had to go to the next one. So my thoughts are that I'm going to probably just um, use one pod per color except um, for 30 of them because I'm going to have 30 extra pods. And um, yeah, I, I'm, I'm just going to, you know, in each category, figure out which one has the most colors in it and stuff like that. So we're going to go over all of that and how I end up figuring that out in the end. But um, if you don't want to go through all of that, putting one color per pod is plenty. And then um, I do have, and then my little hack for knowing that you have more of them is these stickers, they fit perfectly on top of these pods here. I mean, they, they they literally feel like they were meant for them. And what I would do is, is I would put a little star in pencil on ones that I had extras in a baggie for. And so if I ran out or saw a color was running out, I knew I had extras if there was a star in the corner in pencil. I put it in pencil because when I did refill it the last, very last time and I was out of that color, I then erased that star so I knew that there was no more left to refill that, that um, the pot up with, okay? So that was just a little hack I came up with um, in the middle of it. All right. So I just wanted to go into why I'm doing it the way I'm doing it. And you can make up whatever categories you want to make up, whatever you think is going to be the easiest for you, of course. Um, okay, I was looking for the paper that I was using. So I was using this one. So we're going to go back to what I was doing before. Um, so I'm going to now connect the videos and uh, you'll see the beginning parts of this where I already started um, my categories and putting the DMCs on top. 
So I'm just gonna highlight the categories. All right. Um, no, that's not a beer. That's apple juice. <laughs> that's just, I just want to throw that out there. That is just apple juice. Um, so this is going to be, I don't, I don't know how long this kit up is going to be because I don't think it's going to be as long as it was the first time. Um, because I already have my categories and so that's going to be very helpful. So I just went back and I grabbed the categories that I used the first time. And there's quite a few of them. I didn't realize there was this, this many. So triangles, letters and numbers, crosses, people, arrows, transportation, circles, use, tools, technology, weather, square and diamonds, miscellaneous, lines, office, food and drink, and nature. <sighs> okay. I wonder if I should do weather and well, I'm just going to leave it because I um, it it worked well for me last time. So rather than try to uh, rewire my brain, I'm just going to go with it. So I do have some new symbols here, and um, what I'm going to do is is I am going to, so I could either write down next to it the category, but I like to keep on paper. So the reason why I like to have all the categories in a row here is because I, I get to see how many colors are going in each category and then I can organize my boxes appropriately. So I'm gonna be using five of those 56 grid boxes. Let me go get them. So these are the boxes I am using. And so 56 times five is 280, I believe. I have 250 colors, which means essentially I'll have 30 spare uh, pods. So I could double up some of them if there's quite a few of them in here. Um, and, and I might do that, so, because it tells you how many, how many drills in that pack. So let's see, 310, there's only 177 black drills. So there's that, just in case you guys were wondering. So um, the first, so the first thing I'm gonna do is, is I'm gonna put the categories in rows here and then I'm just going to put the DMC numbers underneath of them. So triangles. Letters and numbers. Crosses. People. Arrows. And uh, then I'm gonna go like this far down. Transportation. Circles. Use. Tools. Technology. Weather, I'm going to put miscellaneous here and lines, and then we're going to do square and diamonds and office, 
food, drink. And nature. Oops. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down and I'm going to look at the symbol. So number 150, that's going to go under lines. So lines 150. 152 is going to go under arrows. Now, I'm going to put these under circles, these dots. 154. That's a triangle. I don't know if you can see it. So 155, 156, 157 are all triangles. 154. 5, 156, 157. This is a square. I put those under squares. 158. One sixty. That's like an hourglass. So that can go under office. This car, 161, that's going to go under transportation. This triangle, 163. Okay, so this can go under circles or it can go under... Um, it could actually go under office for like, well, no, I guess not. But I'm going to put this under food and drink because it makes me think of pizza. That's the first thing that came to my mind when I saw it was pizza. So 167 is going under food and drink. This one is going under crosses, 168. That's a microphone, 169. It's going under tools or technology. Hmm. Should that be under tools or technology? Technology. Okay, and this is going to go under use, 208 and 209, use. 208, 209. Here we got triangle 221, triangle 223. And then we have a hand, 301. So that is under people. Um, that's a U, 304. 310 is that like cat eye. It's a line, so it's going under lines. Where's lines? 310. Um, 311, that is a uh, fire that's going under tools. 311. 312 is the shamrock that's going under miscellaneous. Actually, Three, that's a uh, nature, 312. 315 is that triangle, it's going under triangles. 315, 316 is a line, we have lines. 317 is a triangle. 318 is Pac-Man. It's going under people. 319 is the letter A. It's going under letters and numbers. This is uh, like a target, but it's going under circles. 320. 
This is like a biohazard sign. I had this under miscellaneous before and it's going back there. 322, 327 is under use. 333. So this could be under letters and numbers for V, but there's a specific one that is a V. It's a small V. I'm going to put this under triangles because there's quite a bit of them. They're, 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 they're facing all different ways. So that's going to go under triangles. It's where I put it last time and it worked out really well for me. So 333. And then this one, 334, that's going under squares. 334. This boat, 336, transportation. Three forty and three forty one triangles again. Three fifty five goes under lines. Three fifty five. Three fifty six is that telephone. It's going under technology. Before I had it under miscellaneous because it scared me but now I know what it is. 367 is a cross. It's going under crosses. 367. 368 is a line. It's going under lines. 368. Okay, now, this is a new one for me, this like bifold thing. 370, it's gonna go under office because it looks like a pamphlet. So office, 370. That magnet, 371, it's going under use. Okay, so you see this one, it has a square with a triangle in the, uh, an arrow in the middle, it's going under arrows because the arrows in the middle, my, my eye goes to it and I think arrow, so 372. And then we have B407 going under letters and numbers. Whoops, 407. That one right there, 413, that's going under squares. That's where I had it last time, 413. Okay, so 414 can go under lines because that line is in the middle, or it can go under circles. Um, if I stick to my rule, it goes under lines. So I'm going to stick to my rule, 414. So the only time that I don't follow that rule is when it's a dot, because I don't have dots. So if there's a dot in the middle, then I look at the whole symbol. Like that's a U, that's a triangle, but... If there's a line or a cross or something like that, then I follow that, that rule. So I'm going to follow that rule. 414 went into lines. 415, that is um, weather. I feel like weather and nature should go together. I'm going to, I'm going to try to put those two together. 415, like package them together in the box. 420 is an arrow. Where are my arrows? That's all, the, that's the, these are the only arrows I have? That's crazy. No, 221, where did 221 go? Oh man, see, triangles, I did this last time. Triangles and arrows mess me up. So 155, there's a triangle, 156, 157, 163 is a triangle, 221 is an arrow, and 223 is an arrow. See, I did this last time, 221 and 223, 
that's a triangle. 317 is a triangle. 333 is a triangle. 340 is a triangle. 341 is a triangle. And 372 is a triangle. Oh, no, is an arrow. See? Jeez, oh, man. 372, 420. Okay, sorry about that. All right, I got to keep an eye on that. So 422 is a tree, so that's going under nature. 422. 433 is the letter D, so it's going under letter. 434 is a cross, so it's going under crosses. Okay, 435 is a bomb. It's going under tools. They use them in demolition. <laughs> 436 is a moon. It's going under weather. 436. 437 is another kind of Pac-Man. So under people. 437. 451 is this triangle. So it's going under triangles. 451. 452 is a dumbbell, so it's going under tools. 452. 453 is like a stack of sheet of papers, so it goes under office. 453. 469 is a cross, it's going under crosses. 470 is a new one for me, and that looks like a ring, right? So that's going to go under miscellaneous. 470. Um, 471 is a battery symbol, so that goes under technology. 471. 500 is a sad face, so that's people. And then we have a small lowercase i, 501, so letters and numbers. And then I looked at these as lines, squiggly lines, so we're going under lines, 502. Okay, this is an arrow, arrow, 503, arrows. Um, these are like pickaxes and stuff, so they're tools, 505. Now, this is a cloud with an arrow inside of it. The arrow is so small. The first thing and the only thing that you really notice is it's a cloud. So it's going under weather. Um, 517. These are two arrows that have four ends to them. 518 arrows. 518. This is like an iPod. 520 technology. This is like a camera, 522 technology. This is like a magnifying glass with a line in it. So it's going under lines. Uh, 523. Here is a different type of camera, 524. So technology. Here is a computer monitor or a TV, 535 technology. This is a castle, 543 miscellaneous. Here is a key, 550 tools. Um, I looked at this as like a cog wheel. So really it's tools, 552 or a star. I feel like that's a star, 552. We'll do, we'll do that as a star. Okay, now we have uh, 553 and 554 and 561. They're all lines. See the lines in the middle? They're all lines. So all three of these go under lines. 553, 554, 561. Then we have 
that it's like a clock, but I'm going with circles 562. I'm not really sure what it is, but I do know it's a circle. And then 580, that's new. What is that? Like a bathtub? Like a washer, it's saying? Um, we'll put it in miscellaneous. Uh, and then we have a pine tree, 581. That is nature. Uh, and then our first food and drink, a martini glass, 597. Food and, oh no, our second. What was the first one? 167. Oh, the pizza pie. So 597. Okay, and then we have that cube, which is obviously square, 598. And then 610 is the J, a capital J, 610. And then we have a trophy, but I um, put it under food and drink for cups. So it's like a 611. Um, you could also say that that's a, a goblet of some sorts. And then that's like a, like a Christmas ornament, 612. That went under um, circles. And then, now I know that's a train, 613. That's a train on a track coming at you, so it's transportation. Where are you, transportation? Um, 613. There we have a square with a cross in the middle. It's going under crosses, 632. Um... Then we have a floppy disk, guys. Remember floppy disks? Oh my God. 640. Technology. Old ass technology. <laughs> um, then we have arrow up and down, 642. That's going under triangles. Um, then we have the diamond. 644. It's going under miscellaneous. And then we have uh, the apple, 645, food and drink. And then we have like this, it's like either a flag or I, I thought it was like a pickaxe at four, first, 646. It's going under tools, 646. Um, and then we have that bullhorn. 647. Okay, so we left off at 647 was the last one I did. And it was a tool because it was the megaphone, like I said earlier. So the next one is a cloud with the sun behind it, 648. So that is going to go under weather, 648. And then we have this like graph. It's going to go under lines, 680. And then we have a K, 699. And then a flag. So I'm going to say that's tools, 700. M, 701. Is letters and numbers. Uh, that's a new one for me, 702. And that's going to go into lines. Um, it could be, so it could be lines, it could be crosses, and it could be, it could be lines or crosses. But when I saw it, it just, my initial instinct was lines. So I'm going to go with lines. Hmm. I'm going to go with lines. 702. 718 is lines. It's those three lines. And then that battery sign 
is going to go under tools 729 it can go under tools or technology I'm going to put it under tools 729 and then that arrow there was another one of these and um I think I look at that as arrow I think arrows and it was 642 now I put it in triangles so I'm going to put this in triangles too 733 and then we have a a tag i'm going to say that's uh office 734 like a price tag 734 and then this is like a notebook 738 in office and then this is an arrow 758 in arrows and then we have the lion face 762 in people. And then we have these arrows 777. I mean lines, I'm sorry, these lines. Um, and then we have this letter P779 in letters. And then we have headphones. 782, I'm going to put in tools. And then we have a basketball, 783. I'm also going to put in tools. And then we have this, it's like a partial square, so it goes in squares, 791. And that's our first page. And then 792 and 793 both go into squares. Um, 794 goes into triangles because there's a triangle in the middle. And then the cat eye is a line, 796. Seven ninety seven is a partial square. Seven ninety eight is the S, which is letters, and that's a hot air balloon eight oh one. That's going to go into miscellaneous, and then that's a cross eight oh three. Thumbtack goes into office, 807. And then this, it's like, um, I don't know what it is, but it goes into circles, 813. It's like the world or something. So I put that in circles, um, 813. This V with a dot in the middle goes into triangles, 814. This um square with a dot in it 820 also goes in um it goes into squares 820 the feet 823 that goes into people the lock 824 that goes into tools the, the diamond, 825, goes into squares and diamonds. The U with dots on the end goes into U's, 826. The arrow, 831, goes in arrows. The cloud, 832, goes into weather. The H goes into letters, 833. Now this little V is the letter V. So that goes into letters, 834. 
Paper Airplane and Transportation, 838. This arrow, 839. This other airplane facing the diff different direction, 840 in transportation. This full person, 841 in people. Those bullet lines, or I'm not sure what they are, but they're going in lines, 842. The W, 844 in two letters. The music note, eight, not 869. Um, I'm gonna put that in miscellaneous, 869. The flower goes in nature, 890. This half shaded square, 902, goes into squares. Um, I said before this is a piece of bread, 904, so it goes into food and drink. The dot there, 905. Hmm. I guess it's going to go into circles because it's uh, the tiniest circle ever. 917 is that division. Um, I'm going to put that in uh, lines because the line is in the middle. So 917, 820 is X. It's going to go in, or 920, it's going to go into letters numbers and letters. 921 is just that dash mark. It's gonna go into lines. That satellite, 824, is gonna go into technology. The hand, 826 in people. The arrow, it's a it's an arrow. It's a circle with an arrow pointing at the end. Um, so it's 927, it goes in arrows. That big arrow, 928. Um, I say that's like a sound bar. 9.30, so I put that in technology last time. I'm putting it back there. That cog wheel, 9.31 is tools. The movie camera, 9.32 is technology. The Z and the two, 9.34 and 9.38 go into letters and numbers. 9.34, 9. 38, the two arrows, 939 go into arrows, 950 is a camera, it goes into technology, the lamp, 952, 958 is tools. So anything that has to do with light, I'm putting in tools like fire and all of that because it's it's a tool as far as I'm concerned. Number the number three nine seventy five is in letters and numbers. The fire nine seventy six is tools. The soccer ball nine seventy seven is tools. Number five nine eighty seven 987 is letters and numbers. The scale is tools, 988. The letter 
the number six, nine, eighty nine. The, the two dots, it's like a face without a mouth. 991 is in people. That 992 is a square. Goes into squares. The moon, 995 in weather. That traffic sign, 3011, goes into tools. The wrench, 3012 tools. The arrow, 3013 in arrows. Thirty twenty one. the faucet, it's tools. The number eight, 3022 is letters and numbers. 3022. The electric outlet 3023 is in tools. Okay, that I said last time was a screwdriver or something. So that goes in tools, 3024. That part square, 3031 is squares. The star, the shooting star, 3032 is weather. The pickaxe, 3041 tools. The swords, 3042 tools. The suitcase, 3045 is transportation. That bobble, 3046 is circles. The shamrock, 3052 is weather or nature, 3052. The star, 3053 is weather. That triangle, 3064 is triangles. That square, 3072 is squares. That, I guess, what is that? Like a silo or something? 3346. That's going to go into miscellaneous. That is, uh, I put in squares last time, 3347. That's a, that's a diamond, 3348. So it goes in squares and diamonds. That's a book, 3362 into office. Number nine, 3363 into letters. That like scale thing, for some reason I put that in tools. So it's going back there. It's cause I, I guess like measuring cups, speakers, I was thinking 3364. Um, the circle with the line through it goes in circles, 3371. The square, 3685 into squares. These double circles, 3687 into circles. That line, goes into lines, it just has two knobs on the end, 3688. The two arrows pointing different directions, 3721 and 3722 in two arrows. 
the circle with the double circle. They're a little further apart, so they're different than this double circle, but they're another double circle, 37, 26 in the circles. The um, cross, I'm going to be honest with you. I know this is like one of our signs, man or woman. I don't know which one it is. It's pathetic, I know. I don't know why I can't ever remember that. I'm sure there's a, a hack to remembering that, but it goes into crosses. That's where I put it last time. 3727. Um... The hammer, 3740 into tools. Uh, that circle, 3743 into circles. The triangle, 3746 into triangles. Um, that five dots, the die, 3750 into squares. The coffee cup into food and drink, 3752. Um, the, the arrow goes into arrows, 3760. Airplane again, 3765 into transportation. Um, that's like a, a, what, like a picture icon, 3766. That goes into office. Um, those double squares, 3768 into squares. Um, this is a new one for me, 3772. What is that, like a table? I'm not really sure. Oh, it's like... Let me, let me, let me zoom in. Zoom. Hmm. It's like an M with like a roof over it. Hmm. I think I'm going to put it in letters. What do you think? I don't know. It might not look like letters, like on when it's really, really small. It might just look like, I don't know what it looks like. I'm going to put it in letters. Looks looks like an M with a hat. <laughs> 3771. Okay, then we have um, conversation 3772. We'll put that in office. Um, then we have that like up arrow 3774 in arrows. And then we have that square in a square in a square 3776 in squares. And that's a U, again, with two dots on the end, 3778 in U's. We have an iron, 3781 in tools. We have another triangle, 3782 in triangles. We have people with the 3787 foot. We have another flower, 3790 in nature. We have another telephone, 3799 in technology. We have a triangle, 3782 in triangles. Or what did I say? It's 3802. 
3802. 3802. And then that is like, um, I looked at it as a speaker last time, a speaker icon, 3803 in technology. And then we have that partial square, 3807. And then we have the UFO 3808, which is transportation. And then we have the paint roller 3809 in tools. All right, last page. We have, I think these are paint. I don't know what these are. Again, these go in tools 3810. They're like the other ones. Uh, we have a wrench 3814 in tools. We have that line with a circle in the middle, 3814. It goes in lines. That wrench is 3813. Okay, we have the moon, 3815 in weather. We have that triangle, 3816. We have the diamond, 3817, goes into um, squares and diamonds. And then we have this magnifying glass with a cross in it, 3818, it goes under crosses because the cross is in the middle. And I, I remember from the last time, that's where I put it. And then we have all these, these um, triangles, 3820 in triangles. And then we have, I'm not sure what that is, but once I see it, I think U. So it's gonna go under U's, 3826. And we have this cup, 3828 in food and drink. We have these circles, 3830. And we have those dots, 3834. We've been putting the dots in circles. We have G, 3835 in letters. We have that triangle, 3836 goes in triangles. We have that U, 3837 in U's. We have that partial triangle. So it's gonna go under triangles, 3842, 3842. We have the eyeball. 3847, which is people. We have the C, 3843, um, 3848, 3848. And in letters, we have that square, 3849 in squares. We have this yin yang. 3852, it's gonna go in circles. That's a new one for me. We have the lowercase i, 3857. It's going in letters and numbers. We have the hamburger and the apple going into food and drink, 3858 and 3859. We have that person 3860 in people we have the flag going in tools 3861 we have that suitcase 3862 in transportation we have the lightning 3863 in weather 
and we have that circle, 3864. Okay, we've got a lot. Everybody has quite a bit of them, it looks like. So now I'm going to count them up. So triangles has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. So triangles has 22. Um, letters and numbers have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. 24. Crosses have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight, two, four, six, eight. People have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Arrows have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Miscellaneous has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Transportation has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Circles have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Use have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Tools have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Technology has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Weather has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Lines have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Nature has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Food and drink have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Office has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And squares and diamonds have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three. So let's add all these up and make sure we have 250. So this is part of the reason why these kit ups take so long because I'm missing a number now. So I only have 249. So now I have to go through all of these and see which number I'm missing. Um, so I'm going to do that. So I have 150, 163, 167, 168. See, I know where they are. See, this is how good, this is, this is, this is why this is so easy. I know where to look on the page for the number because I know where I put it in what category. So do you see how quick I'm doing that? So this is what I mean by categories just being your friend. So I'm like looking, I'm like, okay, microphone, I know it's technology. You, where's my use? 208, 209, arrow, 221, 223, hand, 
30, 33. Huh. It's an arrow. I found it. 30, 33. Yes. So, there you go. 30, 33. And we got 19. Perfect. All right, so now it's figuring out. Okay, guys, I'm going to end the video here. Um, so this video focuses on um, putting all 250 colors into their category, figuring out how many uh, symbols are in each category. And the next video, I'm going to break down how I figure out which numbers and uh, symbols go into what pod. So if you like this video, if you wouldn't mind giving me a thumbs up on the way out. And if you want to see me complete this kit up, come back for another video. I just didn't want to make like a two, three hour video. This um, These projects, they take a lot of time to kit up. So I will come back with uh, how I put them in their pods. You guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. Take care. Keep diamond painting.